A busy early Saturday morning for Grand Forks police and sheriff's deputies. We start off around 3 a.m. when uh, police were dispatched to a report of a stolen motor vehicle that had just occurred. Officers located the vehicle northbound on uh, North Washington Street and a vehicle pursuit was initiated. Officers followed the vehicle for several blocks attempting to get it stopped. Officers lost the vehicle and the pursuit was terminated. A short time later, the same vehicle was located at the loaf and jug and an officer attempted to make contact with the female driver. The female again fled from officers traveling westbound on Gateway Drive out of town where the pursuit was uh, then started by Grand Forks County deputies. Deputies followed the vehicle out west past the airport and uh, I'm told by the uh, Sheriff's Department the vehicle then turned north on the road to Kelly's Slough. Spike strips were used and the driver was apprehended. Handed. Police say the driver has been identified as 21-year-old Farah Darko of Grand Forks. She was the only occupant of the vehicle and was transported to the Grand Forks County Correctional Center by deputies. Charges are pending for fleeing in a motor vehicle and theft of a motor vehicle. Then, just after 5 a.m. on this Saturday, another pursuit. Uh, police were dispatched to the 600 block of 8th Avenue North for a report of a violation of a disorderly conduct restraining order in progress. As officers arrived to the area, the suspect vehicle was seen leaving, but they lost sight of it. Officers relocated the vehicle and attempted a vehicle stop in the 1100 block of North 5th Street. The vehicle pulled over for a short time, but the male driver, the lone occupant, refused to exit. The driver then fled at low speed and eventually stopped in the 800 block of Cherry Street. The driver, identified as 37-year-old Grand Forks resident Wesley Johannesson, was taken into custody without further incident. Johannesson was charged with a violation of a disorderly conduct restraining order, a DUI, DUI refusal, reckless driving, and fleeing in a motor vehicle. I'm Neil Carlson reporting for iNews.tv.